Vlogmas day seven be like? Really, I cannot believe that we're all the way in a week for Vlogmas. It's been a lot of fun. So I'm leaving the house. I have the tripod that came with this camera has um, like it bends and it's that material like the silicone, I guess. It's like non, like it sticks and it don't slide. So I've got it bent. It looks like a full on octopus on my dash and i've but it sits up too tall but i kind of wedged it but it didn't turn it didn't move when i just turned so but anyways it is 10 30 i've been up um since 7 30 this morning i am headed to walmart it is so nasty and I, again today and i think it's supposed to be nasty the rest of the week um so um i'm headed to walmart because today i'm doing like a self-care day i want to wash my hair i want to exfoliate self tan do my nails and just have like a chill day you know but um i uh i'm i don't have like i'm out of a lot of my self-care stuff like i'm out of my exfoliating gloves like to exfoliate my skin i'm out of my sugar scrub um and also i just a tip too if you didn't know that because i just found this out too it didn't even occur to me like if you're doing um a self tanner and you use a more like a natural based body wash it doesn't create that build up that build up layer on your skin so it just helps your self tanner last longer and it just helps it soak into your skin better so i'm gonna go get that native brand it is more expensive but i have smelt it before and it does smell really good and um like i was self tanned i self tanned the day before vlogmas started and it like as i would edit my videos within three days it was gone that's just not you know it's just crazy so i'm going to get this native body wash and um use the same self tanner and see if it lasts longer and if it lays better and if i get like a better color payoff kind of thing we'll see maybe not but um that just that's why i'm going to walmart for that kind of stuff we're out of coffee so i have got to stop by duncan first and get a coffee and if you have not had a cookie butter cold brew from duncan with two creams it's so good it's so good so i need that first then i'm gonna go to walmart and then i've got to hurry in there because i have to go to the car rental place and pick up at marcia because she's dropping off their vehicle that they just rented while they were in florida and um got to pick her up and take her home and then i'll be back home to start my self-care day so i'm excited i'm gonna browse walmart too um if i have the time just to like find some cute little things i do i feel so bad that I feel like I need to be doing something. Like, I feel like I need to be sitting in Santa's lap or something every day for Vlogmas. But, um, so I'm trying to just at least make it interesting if it's not Christmassy. But Friday will probably be like the really next Christmassy thing. But, because Jared's going to be off with me. But anyways, I'll stop rambling. I'm headed to Duncan to get my coffee and I'll actually check back in when I get it because I want to show you how good it looks. It's so good. Finally just got my coffee. I'm so aggravated. Like I understand being shorthanded and stuff, but like 
this Duncan, it had just, it, it's, it's always the same. Always the same. They have an attitude. They take 20 minutes. They do one car at a time. It is always like this. Because I, like where we live, we have to drive like over the interstate bridge to get to anything. So, um, like, yeah, we have like the big cool gas stations and stuff, but like, it's just so busy. And I should have known not to stop because now it's 11. But anyway, so um, here's the cookie butter cold brew. Look at the cookies at the top. Like, can you see that? Hang on. I don't know if that helped. But it smells so good. Is that picking up? There we go. It looks so good. So yeah, I just got a small cookie butter cold brew with two creams. Oh my god, it's so good. But yeah, when I pulled up, the person in front of me got like three bags, ten coffees. But when I pulled up, I was just sitting there, so I was kind of like this. So, I'm obviously body language. I'm sure she like read the room or whatever, but it's like, it's how she apologized. Like, I, first of all, I don't need an apology. Like, I get it. I've worked customer service. I worked in retail pharmacy for Christ's sake. And, um... It's just, it's how she said that she was, she, that she was sorry. I was like, she was sorry about your way. I was like, oh, you're fine, you know? And then it's like the attitude behind it for one. But then the second one, she goes, it's just us two back here. And I'm like, y it's fine. Like, it is what it is. It's one of those situations where I couldn't go around or back up to leave, or I would have, because they've got like this big thing on the side. And then I was, I was blocked in. I just needed to vent for a second. I'm so annoyed. And I feel bad for being like that. But like I said, it was the attitude behind the two apologies. Like, I didn't need the second one. Like, I wasn't rude. So, I don't, like, I didn't need the set, the, all the explanations. But whatever. This tripod is garbaggio. Right, I've got y'all balancing on, like, two bags. But I just got back from Walmart, so I wanted to show you guys what I got back from Walmart and dropping it Marsha off. Then I was over there for like 30 minutes because she's going nuts. Um, a few videos back I had said about they had like a little skunk spray two days before they left Florida. She just want me to see because I mean she has been, she's had windows open, air purifiers going. She went to um, and got a commercial thing that they use like when people pass and like their house, you know, like that stuff like that. She's boiled vinegar. I mean, she's done everything. And unfortunately, like being at home for a few days, going back to her house, I really can still smell it. So she's going nuts. But anyway, so I bought black bean and garlic Tostitos to try. Um, and I got me a buffalo style chicken flatbread pizza because I'm on my own for dinner tonight because Jared is taking, uh, um, not just Jared, but the guy, the, the canine seminar that they're in, this like obviously like this is where we live. So they've had other canine handlers come from like different parts of everywhere. So they're taking them out to dinner tonight. So I'm on my own for dinner. Then I got some Doritos dip, a spicy nacho flavor to try with these. And I still have not ate anything today, so I just grabbed like one of the little chicken sandwiches that were on under the heat lamp. And then I'm gonna have like half of that tonight, okay? And then I got some cotton rounds we were out of. I needed a new loofah desperately. And I got a couple more hand soaps. I, just a little FYI, I love foam hand soaps. And this Scent Theory brand is so good. And they're like $2 and something. So I got two of those. And this is the exciting stuff. So I got, I was out of um, Sugar Scrub. <coughs> Millie! I was out of sugar scrub and this is the cocoa colada. 
I was looking for the peppermint one, but they didn't have any. Oh yeah, that's gonna be a mess if I open that. But since I'm self tanning, I needed this, I'm out. I got some of this native body wash in the coconut vanilla. This stuff smells really good. It's $8 and something, but honestly, if it works, it's worth it. So, and then I got a, um, a exfoliating bath mitt um, for this to exfoliate before my self tanner. And then, okay, we had a fiasco with my house shoes. My other house shoes, my little fuzzy leopard ones, they're done, they're done. And I got them from Walmart, I kid you not, like a year and a half, two years ago. They are my favorite, I almost got really upset. But I got the little Ugg dupe platform house shoes from Walmart. And I got a size nine, I usually wear an eight, but I did try these on. I just like to go up a size in my house shoes because I feel like with all the fuzzy and the poof and stuff, you're almost compromising at least half a size. So I just always go up. Can't wait to wear those. And then the last thing I got is this cute set of pajamas. I'm not gonna open it all the way because I wanna surprise y'all. But I have been wanting, I don't have any matching sets when it comes to loungewear or pajamas. And I've been really wanting to do better with that because working from home, I, there's something about taking your shower and wearing something that matches, even if it's comfortable, that makes you still feel like you're put together, you know? So I was gonna get some Christmas ones, but I saw these black and gold ones, which is Christmassy, but I can still wear these after Christmas because they're very like neutral. So, and I wanted ones with like the button front. So I'm so excited to wear those. And that'll be good for like after I self tan, just something loose because I don't sleep in a lot. So I just don't have like matching sets. And I don't, I, I don't want you guys to constantly see me in the same beige lounge set. But two, I don't want to keep, cause I'm washing it over and over. And um, I don't wanna wear it out. So yeah, that's the little grocery haul. I'm gonna eat this little chicken Sammy and then I'm gonna start my self care and bring you guys along. Hello, a long time no see. It's actually been a little bit in the balance. It is 6.30. Jared got, was on his way home at around four, and then he just left to go eat with those guys. And I'm fixing to make my little flatbread pizza that I got earlier from Walmart. So, I have, like I've showered, shaved, washed my hair, exfoliated, dried my hair, Nothing crazy. So Aunt Marcia, I was going on and on about my feet. Um, TMI probably. But <laughs> she got me this little thing. It's an electric foot um, thing. <laughs> it done really good on my feet. Like... I'm gonna see if I can find this on Amazon and link it. Um, it came with this, it has a cover, it came with an extra little head, um, and then it came with this, like that's how you charge it. So I'll see if I can find it on Amazon and link it. But um, I waited too late to do my self tanner, like, like to allow myself enough time for it to sit, plus wash it off before bed. So I'm just gonna have to do it right before bed because my self tanner be looking a little janky if I let it sit for more than eight hours, but I still have to do my nails and everything. So I'm gonna be up a little bit later. I have Laguna Beach season one play. But another update, after I done my feet, I lathered them in my goat's milk lotion and I put my new house shoes from Walmart on, linking, linking these. These are so good. 
Um, so Aunt Marcia gave me a little pair that she had. So those are gonna be for outside and these are staying in the house. I absolutely love these. They're so comfortable. I love them. And then here is my new pajama set. Absolutely love. So I'm gonna link this too, but I will say this about it. I got my true size. I like, I like my pajamas not to fit like skin tight. I like my pajamas to be big. So I got my true size in these and I would say the top is pretty oversized. Like a, a not by a lot, but it's still oversized. And then the bottoms are, they don't have a drawstring. And they're pretty, like I could have went down a size, I guess is what I'm saying, if I wanted them to fit. But I got my true size and they're oversized. So if you order these. And I've noticed on Walmart's website, if you order online, you get better deals. I can't remember what it was that I bought at Walmart not too long ago. Oh, it was my adapter for my SD card like the other day, last week, um, for my SD card to put into my phone. It was $20 on the website. Then when we, when we went in to get it, it was 28. But you get like that big of a discount when you order online, so. But anyway, so I'm gonna cook my little flatbread pizza and then I'm going to do my nails and I'm gonna show y'all how I do my press-ons. So, I'm hungry. So let's make this pizza. Okay, so that pizza was really good so i am in the bedroom fixing to turn on like some vlogmas so i can catch up on other people's vlogmas and but i wanted to show you everything i use for my at home nails so i typically use like a press on kit like hang on <clears throat> like ones that come in a set already but i recently have been loving like getting the plain nails and painting them myself so actually i just remembered hang on i gotta go get that but first so i'm gonna i'll link all of this also um, so these nails, this has a hundred, this is a hundred piece set from Walmart and it's the Kiss brand. So this was $5 for a hundred nails and like the pinky ones and stuff, like they're truly so good. And then let's see, I use, um, of course I just push, push back my cuticle uh, cuticles and just go around my nails and make sure they're cleaned up. Nail file. I use a drill. Uh, yeah, I use a drill. I've got some, well, I got these today from Walmart because I was out. But, and then right before I do anything else, I dehydrate my nails with the alcohol. And then I have, um, a base coat and a top coat. I really love Essie um, brand. And then this time I'm going to use, I know it's winter time, but I love like nudes and neutrals and like soft pinks and whites. That's just, just me. So I'm doing um, OPI bubble bath. Stinking love this. And then I'll show y'all, I've got to go actually go get my nail glue, but I cure everything like after each step, um, I cure them in this light. Now I will say I got this light in a kit at Walmart and I do not recommend it. The light is good enough, but I don't like the products that come with it. Um, but I do, the light is decent. 
but I'm going to link one on Amazon that I actually has really good reviews and that I'm probably going to have to just break down and get. It's not expensive or anything and it actually comes with like a lot. But I'm going to go run and get that glue and show you guys uh, what nail glue I use. Okay. Anyway, just had to clear my SD card card off again sorry um so here's the nail the nail glue it's the kiss brand it's um the power flex max speed it does dry really fast i will say that i really do like it but i'm gonna link um another kind that i've found that's really popular i've noticed that a lot of people use and it's the brush on i would rather brush on than use this but i keep this in my purse that's why it wasn't in here after i do my nails because they the only like i kept those nails that i had on that i was like trying to take off the other day i had to pull these off like these fingers these popped off twice but i mean I don't know. It is what it is when you put when you do your own nails, but it doesn't bother me. Like if these these did not budge, but I like doing my own nails because I like to change them up. I don't like to go two and three weeks in between because I just get bored. But I like this is my me time. Like everything I've done today, like when Jared even got home, he was like, "You've had a good day, haven't you?" I was like, "Yeah." I mean, this is my this is what I do one day out of the week that just, like, sets me up for a good mood for the rest of the week, you know? So, um, I'm going to do my nails. I'm probably not going to do, like, I'm not going to film it since I just went into a really in-depth of what I do. But, of course, I'll show you all the after and then later... It is 7.45 right now. It'll probably take me, it'll probably take me about an hour to do my nails. But then um, I'll probably do myself tanner a little bit later. Obviously, I'm not going to show y'all that because I have to be Nike. But I'll show y'all what I use. And it's, I, I'm trying to use up what I have before I get something else. I love trying new self tanners. I've self tanned for seven years and I absolutely love it. Um, uh, so I'm trying to use up my tanologist, which is at the very top of my favorite list for me. And it's very clear, like it has, it don't have a color guard, but I swear you can't mess it up. So I'm gonna do my nails. And I got my phone out because I'm going to turn on, I was going to turn on Vlogmas, but there's this show on Netflix and let me know if y'all have watched it. I heard a lot of people talking about that show like Wednesday, I guess like a spinoff or whatever from the Adams Family, but this, okay, the Texas Killing Fields, but I don't know if, oh, if I need to watch that by myself. Because I'm kind of um, a baby. It's like a documentary. Like, that's fun. I, I don't know. Oh my gosh, if y'all have never watched Father of the Year with Dane Cook. Uh, or not Dane Cook. David Spade. Oh my gosh, it's so funny. <laughs> it's so funny. But yeah, I don't know. I'll probably just turn on Vlogmas because if I sit, like I have a huge, like, I have a huge mirror right in front of me. And if I sit just right, I can see the TV while I do my nails. So I'm actually probably just going to do that. And then I'll show y'all my nails when I'm finished. Do that again to her. Oh, look at my makeup on my pillow. I gotta wash sheets. Yeah. Come here. No, baby, my pants are undone. I've got your face. Well, they were loving on each other. Here, look man. at my makeup on my pillow. I've gotta wash sheets. 
Oh, uh, they were playing together. Yeah. I'm halfway done yeah. with my nails. I've just rounded them out. Mm, so, time to paint. Hey, baby girl. <laughs> Love her. Um, a little update on the nails. I was doing so well. And then this one, I went to seal it and it rubbed everything off. And I just don't know, like, do you like that color? I'm talking to you, the cameraman. It's like- Is there even a color? Yes, it's, is it focusing on my nails? I think so. They're yeah, there you are. Perfect, obviously, but it's that bubble bath. But I'm gonna do my tan tonight, so I know that it'll make it look better. That's just so aggravating because I went to like seal it with the alcohol like you're supposed to do, like I've done before, and it must I must not have cured it long enough in the lamp, and it just like peeled it all, all the color off. But that's three coats of that color. I don't know. I don't know if I want to even finish on tonight. I kind of just want to peel them off. But they look really bad around my cuticles. I just, I've not had good luck with this glue lately. So, look at Millie. Uh, let me see the camera. So, I'm annoyed. Like, they're not perfect. Hang on. But like I went to seal it like I always do and it just completely wiped off everything, which it's not a big deal. But I've just, I've not been liking that glue. See, look what I just did. That's so annoying. So I am not gonna link that glue because honestly it sucks. And a lot of people say that's their favorite glue. But like it balls up around my cuticles like if you can see that and it's just it's annoying because it makes it look like i didn't prep my cuticles good and i have already filed these and everything and now they're just that's so annoying so it is what time is it 909 i'm probably not going to I'm probably fixing to try to peel these off honestly and then i'm gonna self tan tomorrow so that is the end of this vlog. Also, if you've never watched Superstore, it's like the best show. What do you say? Yeah, it's probably one of the best little comedy sitcom deals. It's like my go-to for when I don't know what I want to watch. And it's just like background noise, but um, it's 9.09. I gotta start editing this vlog. So, <laughs> Just wasted an hour and a half on these nails. Like the nails are fine, but the glue, it's just like those look really good how I shaped them and stuff, but I'm just not even wasting my time, you know? Yeah. Don't look at Axel's bed. It's so bad. He shed so bad. We I need to get him a new bed. But so yeah, I'm going to self-tan tomorrow so I can just put this on. And, um, yeah, be good to go. And we're going to work on the closet tomorrow. And we're going to wrap some Christmas presents and self-tan tomorrow. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I will see you tomorrow.